Hello everyone and welcome to the latest material energy 4. I'm just at the bottom of the nether sphere as I need to gather some of these blocks for my quest book uh, called Cellucleus. Cellucleus, I think I said that right. So I just gotta grab about 10 of these blocks and once I've done that I'm gonna meet you up top because I want to st make a little start on chemistry today and I need to make myself a chemical uh, reconstructor or whatever you call it a chemical synthesizer so I gotta be doing some work on that so I'll meet you up top once I grab about 10 blocks here and, uh, I've managed to get myself some aldrite, some more aldrite, and a bit of this new stuff, Sarewoolly Clays, however you say it. <laughs> and uh, we're just going to do the detection quest now. So let me just update this a second. So we're going to get, oh, we're going to get loads more for that. And a quadruple compress. So let's clean that. Excellent. Right, let's have a look at our quest book now. Uh, we've got this one over here called. Well, I might as well do this one first before we do the chemistry stuff. So, combining those two, so we need 10 of those blocks. So, if I throw these in my smeltery, uh, we'll put the rest in. We'll sort the rest out later on. Oh, looks like my. Applied Energistics is starting to fill up, so I might have to make some more drives for that sometime in the future. Right, let's throw in these guys here now, and that should give me 10 of each, I think. So let's see if this works now. Let's throw 5 of them in. And 5 of them in, or oh, we need to wait for that. I should have made a taller smelter, really. And we're out of lava. Okay, we'll have to go and grab some from here. As I've set up the system slightly different here. Let's throw some lava in the system. I should cook it up now. So let's wait for that and we can update the next quest then. And we just waiting for the last one now. We just cooked up all that and it's given us in no last height, however you say that, and uh, it should allow us to update that quest now, so we've got 10 of them now, so let's update the quest. Uh, oh, you need to turn that into ingots actually, okay, maybe I made a few too many, but never mind, you can always use the extra. I should manually update now, let me just do one more. There we go, 100%. So that's going to give us another block and a reward bag. So, where are we in the quest book now? So, we can make a Lumite. We can... We're not quite with the Lost Souls yet, because we need the chemistry and the same with the Glowstone. So, let's, let's go with the chemistry side of things, shall we? So we're going to need to make ourselves a, a chemis chemical synthesis machine and a microscope. And I should unlock some of these quests then. Right, let's do that now then. So we want the chemical synthesizer. So the part we want to make is the atom enlarging module. And you should be able to make that straight away now. We're just short on one of these away. Ooh, I thought I had more copper than that. Uh, that, sh that solved the problem. And let's grab that now. Let's throw that, throw that in there. Ooh, we're a bit full up away. Ooh, okay. Right. So we're definitely going to have to make some more drives sometime. Let's see if this lets me click on it now. Please let me click on it. Right, there we go. One basic compressor. Let's clear that out. We should be able to make this now. Okay. 
Okay, throw that in there. And I think I got some lab blocks. We need to make one of these as well, do we? Okay, that's easy enough. Let's make ourselves one of them first. Nine. And throw them in there if I can. Let's take something out. Let's grab that. There you go, one of them. Let's clear all that out. Let's take let's take one or two items out of here a minute. And we'll t put that in there. So we've got those two now. So we can put them in there. That should allow us to make our synthesizer. Excellent. Right, so I've set up a place here ready. And we're ready to roll. Although I probably move that somewhere else to be more efficient because we're gonna output a lot of this stuff into another inventory system somehow. But we haven't got any more of those drives at the moment, so that could be a problem. You may have noticed also I've added these two items I found last episode and I found out what they did. They one of them heals you and one of them charges up your items. And as you may notice I've got the crazy pants magnet from earlier on in this series and you don't need to place this in item all you got to do is just stand on the pads and they charge up your items just like that and i've also got the healing one which will heal me up at the same time so two for the price of one so excellent right so let's have a look at our book now so we've done that quest there so we can claim that reward but i don't think i got room in my inventory that's a bit better. So let's claim that reward. Now what did that give us? That gave us a leather chest for any element, radioactive elements, and it gave us another quest bag. So I think we'll open these quest bags a minute. Let's clear out a little bit, shall we? Right, what have we got? We got two good, three good, and a greater. Shield. Some cable, more explosives, and what's in the grater? Please be something nice. Ooh, Tesseracts. That's nice reward. Right, any more bags? Nope. So, I place a few chests here to store a few things now and again. Let's put some of these guys in here. So we've got three Tesseracts. That's a really nice reward that was. Let's put them in there, and the cookie. What was that? That was the lead stone. Alright, just have a look at the quest book. See any up there? No? Right. We'll carry on with the chemistry, and we need to make a microscope. So let's have a look at the microscope. Should be an easy one, I think. So what we need to make is one of these microscope lenses. So I'm going to make a two convex lenses. That should be easy. Let's do that now. Right, two of them and one of them. And we should be able to make it now. Let's grab that. Right, next up we need to do all that, do we? Right. So that goes there, I think. Yeah. And there's our microscope. Right. We'll put this, I'd say, just over here a little bit. Ooh, I don't know. Well, it probably are gonna, it looks like we're gonna have to move some things around. So we'll put it over here for now. Looks like a good spot. Perfect. Oh, what was that? There's something extra there. I haven't seen that before. Oh, that's a support button. So it's more or less the same as in Material Energy 3. So we've done that now. We should be able to... Oh, we need a chemist journal, do we? Okay, let's make one of them to update the quest. So there's a book and a bit of glass, of course. I don't know if I've got any books in here. 
And I can easily make them if I got any paper. What about some sugar cane? Yeah, I've just got enough. So let's grab that. Get ourselves a book. We're short on string away. I thought I had more string. No, I have got string. It's the it's these things I'm short on, so let's grab them. Thank you. Let's put them in there. And let's do the auto thing again. There you go, one book. And all we need now is a bit of glass, of course. So let me throw that in there and quickly make this. There you go, one chemist journal allows us to update the quest. So we'll put that book straight in there, ready to roll. So what's that going to give us? It's going to give us some um, elements here and a reward bag. Right, now what type of elements are these? Let's have a luxury. That's going to make all them. We'll probably have a look at them more closely later on. Let's have a look at the bag now. A nether shovel. What's that got on it? So that's using... Uh, let's have a look. So that's made out of netherrack, is it? Okay, and what um, level is it at? Awesome level. Okay, we'll take a peek at that later on. Let's put that with the rest. And uh, let's store these chemicals in here. They're not radioactive. No, good. Right, so let's get open up the quest book a bit now. So we need to make some... Breaking down sugar cane can produce raw sugar in the form of cyclose. Right. So we got to grab some sugar cane over here. Let's break that down in the decomposer. Right by here. Okay, so that's given us that. I hope it was one we needed. Let's have a look. Was it one? No, we needed ten, do we? Mm, okay. Let's throw them all in. And that's giving us five. And we're short. So we're probably going to have to wait for that to grow a little bit. Unless I've got some bone meal. Let's, let's do it with bone meal, is it? I got one bit of bone meal and loads of bones, so I'll do that. Oops. Let's grab that back. Okay, so we only need five more pieces really, so Right, so let's do that. Throw them in there. And we would have to be one short. That is just typical. Right, <laughs> let's grab one more bone. Let's just get a load of bone meal out of that. And once this is automated, it'll make things a lot easier. Okay. Right, I should be able to update it now. Sure. There we go. Right, just grab all that and let's update that quest. What are we going to get? Reward bag and some swiftness potions. Oh, and it's opened up here because we're going to need all the different types of trees. So, fusion reactor. Alright, and the fission reactor. We've got to make helium there. And we got all these different chemicals to do, so that's refills hunger and cleans my teeth from all those cookies. <laughs> so yeah, we oh and there's the poly tool. So the poly tool is quite close, so we've got to get this and we've got to work our way up here. Excellent. Any more quests there? Right, so I'm going to have a look at 
difficult chemical, I can't even say it. I'm going to have a look at the different chemical recipes now and we'll try and clear out some of these like glowstone and there was another one here, lost souls because we need soul sand and there was one more, I can't remember. So I'll see you once I've uh, looked up those recipes. Right, let's take a look at some more of those chemistry items in the quest book. So, we've got a couple over here which we need to unlock. And we got to do some glowstone with phosphorus. But we've got to work away way out to do that. And you can get that from bones. And we've got a soul sand to make. So why don't we do the soul sand first. So we've got to get 20 pieces of soul sand and if you remember earlier we collected some of this coloured sand so why don't we throw that in the decomposer to see what we get. We should get a variety of things really. Ooh, I think I need to get that lead chest. As uh, so we've got some radioactive so that's got one hour so we've got enough time. Let me find where I put that leaded chest, there it is. So we're going to need that to go, say, but there for now. Perfect. Uh, How is this doing? Right, that's all done. So let me just check there's no radioactive ones there now. So let's grab them out of there and we put them straight in there for safety. Okay, so how's that doing there? What do we get? We got cobalt, uh, serene, silicon, lead, oxygen, and a, f a few other ones now to make soul sand. We require lead, beryllium, Silicon and oxygen, and that's for one, right? Okay, and I think we're gonna need some more, aren't we? So we only got one from that. Okay, let's grab some more out of this chest here. I haven't got that many colored sand, have I? Let's try the black. Let's throw that there. Hopefully it'll give us a few more. I don't know if it's going to give us any radioactives, but we'll see what happens now. So it's only giving us two, is it? Mm, looks like we're going to be a bit busy doing this, I think. Okay, so we'll just make the recipe up. So we needed lead, silicon and oxygen. So let's grab all them. See silicon. And we needed the lead. There it is. Silicon. Now, do we need serine for that? Nope. Right, so I've got to make a book, right? Right. So I did make a chemical journal, I'm sure I did. Let's see if I've uh, misplaced that somewhere. Turns out that I'd already made it, and it's in the microscope here. So let's make one piece of soul sand to add the ingredients to this. So let's have a look at the recipe now. First of all, we're going to make it. So let's go to the synthesis machine. So we need three lead. Let's put that there. Um, one of them, brilliant. So we're halfway there. We've just got to put them in the right position and we need two silicon and one oxygen so two silicon and one oxygen so that should give me soul sand there you go so let's throw all these in here that's all of them yeah so let's grab what we can so it's going to be two so far, so what am I short on? I think we're short on oxygen, no. Lead. 
So I want to be short on there. Oh, we got no power. How have we got no power? That's a, that's a good question. I did have power in here. Yeah, power's going in, but I don't know why there's no power to this guy here. Energy needed. Oh, it needs quite a lot of power, actually. So we're going to have to leave that charge up for a little while, no doubt. Let's see how much is in there. Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's our reason why. It's quite high energy requirement to make one item, so we'll just have to leave that charge for a while. But while we're here, we might as well learn the recipe. So let's throw it, take that out. There you go, and then that should make things a bit easier when we want to make stuff in the synthesizer. That's all we have to do is just grab that out of there. Right. Nice and simple. So we got to carry on doing this, let this charge up. And we should have finished that quest now. Let me just throw in some of these guys. Got some more beryllium there. So let's throw that in there. So that's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we need three more of them. Let's grab the radioactive stuff. So I'm going to let this charge up and we'll try and finish that one quest. All right, we've got enough uh, beryllium now to finish this off. So hopefully I'll have enough power. And we're short on six, so we still have to wait on that. So we'll gradually get that over time. But we got everything we require to make it. So while we're waiting on that, we might as well check another quest. Because we can easily come back to that one. So let's have a look at glowstone now. So we're going to need to synthesize glowstone dust, are we? Right, so how do we do that? With bones, is it? Right, let's see now. So how many bones have we got? Yeah, probably got absolutely none in here now, no my luck. Let's grab that many. Let's see what we get from 64. But f before we do that, let's quickly learn the recipe. There we go. Now let's decompose this. Let's see what we get. Right, we should get uh, phosphorus from that. Alright, so it's come, it's by there, is it? Right, okay, so we've got to break that down again. There we go, and that gives us calcium, phosphite, that's what we wanted. Right, so how many did we need for the quests? Tw 30, do we? Right, okay, we're throwing a few more bones. That gives us that. So break that down again. There we go, there's our phosphorus. Now, if we put this in here you now, it should give us phosphorus. Yeah, excellent. Right, let's put that in. I'm probably going to have to empty out some of these chemicals by the look of it. Come on, give me 30. Let's take that out. Take the oxygen out. And take that out. Right, now what did the quest say? Now how do we make glowstone? Let's have a look. Glowstone is made. Well, that's quite simple really. Only problem now is the power, of course. And we're still waiting for this guy here, so let me just see how that's doing. Two more to go. And we needed 30 glowstone, didn't we? And we got no power. So, I'll tell you what, I'll carry on finishing this, let it charge up, and we'll come back once we've got enough power to actually make this glowstone and this soul sand, which is nearly complete. Right, we should have enough uh, stuff in here now, energy-wise, to make 30 glowstone. So I hope this works now. Let's see what happens.
Uh, 31, there we go. So I've gone ahead and done the soul sand as well. So we've got them two quests complete, hopefully. Four quests complete. So let's open up that now. Uh, oh, and it's opened up the amber wall for us. Excellent. And I went ahead and made myself a tool forge in between episodes. So we've got those four quests to open up now. So why do we do that now? So we're going to get a few goodies there. See if, if I've got any space. And we should get a soul vial. And a soul fragment. Mm. And let's open up the amber wool as well. Let's see, yep, got plenty of space. Excellent. And of course, let's claim that reward as well, which I can't because I got no space. So let me throw in some of these buckets in here. Claim that. And we can offload some stuff now. So let me just put a few in there. I'll do it. And we should be able to add in another red heart canister now. Brilliant. Right. So let's see what uh, happens with the quest book now. So what's been opened up? So we got blazing. Promethium buckets, which we've got to get from the bottom of the nether. And we've got to get the nether wart from the bottom as well, which we didn't get. And I think we need witch water and we need to get some wither skeletons from down in the nether as well. So that's all I can do there for now. So let's pop over to chemistry a second. Now, another one we want to make is XYL, uh, I don't know how to say it, Xyliltol. So that's supposed to refill hunger and cleanse my teeth at the same time. So <laughs> let's quickly have a look at that recipe. So where is it? There it is. So that's made up from... 5 carbon, 12 hydrogen, and 5 oxygen. So that's a nice easy one. How many do we need to make? Well, just the one. So let's do that now. So let's get rid of that. So... 5 carbon. Uh, we need soul sand for this, don't we? Have we got any wood is a good question. Okay, let's cook up this in the redstone furnace. Oh, that's strange why that don't work for me. So put... Okay, I can't apparently cook up this. So have I got any coal in here? Because i got a funny feeling... Oh, I'm alright. So let's break that down. And I'm going to have to make up some room here a second. Let me just clear up a few. Throw in the coal. Should give me plenty of carbon there. Let's grab that back. Right, so how many do we need? Five, isn't it? So let me go to the synthesizer. One, two, three, four, five. And hydrogen. Have we got any hydrogen as a quest? I did have some from a quest. Yeah, Twelve, perfect. Whoop. <clears throat> so let's do that. Twelve of them. And lastly, we will need some oxygen. So five oxygen. There we go. We should be able to make it now. So let's grab that. Excellent. And let's update the quest. Alright, so that's opened up. A big chunk by here now. So we've got our potion, uh, our potion to, or chemical to see in the dark. We've got amino acids, aspirin for healing, uh, testosterone for speed and healing, I think. And we're going to have a lot of stuff to combat stuff down in spatial cells. 
So I'm going to do a bit of organising and I'll be right back. Okay, now we've made a few chemicals, I think it's time we started to look at stuff to help us combat enemies and so on. And the last chemical I'm going to make today is going to be some aspirin. So, and there's a quest here called aspirin. So we've got to make this up. So let's do that now. So the recipe for this is... Let's have a look here. Um, nice and easy. Carbon, hydrogen and oxygen. However, we need to get ourselves a better source of carbon. So I'm probably, after I've made this, I'm going to work my way up here in between episodes to get at these saplings. To give us a better source of wood, which you can actually break down in the smelteries over there. So let's make this item now. So we needed carbon. Well, actually, before we do this, let's uh, learn this recipe. There we go. Nice and done. Right. So, let's make up our aspirin. So, 5.12.5. And we need to change it slightly to 9.8.0. Oh. Yeah, 9.8.0. Oh. Right. So... Let's do that. One, two. It's nine. I uh, forgot the recipe already. Would you believe? Ah, uh, so it's nine eight four. So hydrogen and four, hydrogen three four, and five of them in it. Or is it six? I can't remember. Now what did I do wrong there? 984. 984. That's what I did wrong. Got that out of there. 1, 2, 3, 4. And that gives us some aspirin. So let me see what we're short on. For some reason, I can't grab that out of there. So we've got carbon. We've got. Oh, it's hydrogen I need. Okay. Oops, let's grab that back. So to get hydrogen, we'll probably need some water or something. So let's have a look at that. Let's see what options we got. I can put cobble in there. Or I can put water. And yeah, it's water. So I've got to get a, a water, break down some melons or something. So let's go and grab some over the here. Right, now, if I break these down, hopefully I should get water. Like, just like that. Right, so let's do that. I might as well learn the recipe while I'm here. Let me just throw that in there. Okay. And let's throw in the decomposer. That's my water. And we got to convert the water over to hydrogen now. So to do that, we just break it down in the decomposer. Let's see, where did I put it? Ah, there it is. Right, let's break that down. Okay, here's my hydrogen. Uh, let's throw that in there. And there we go. we got some aspirin now, so let me grab a few of them, because we're going to need them. Perfect. So let me learn that recipe for future and grab it back and we've now got healing potions or I could make the other version with the brewing stand but I think these versions are a lot better and cheaper for me so let me see what kind of time limit we got okay so that's been a bit nerfed <laughs> as you can see yeah, that's been nerfed extremely, so we've got like four seconds of healing now, so... Oh well, we're going to have to make lots more of these by the looks of it. But we're coming to the end of the episode again. So, 
I'm going to be busy with the chemicals in between episodes now, and we're going to make some progress towards here. And we'll see what trouble we can get up to next episode. Because if you noticed, I opened up this cell here. However, it didn't give me a spatial cell this time. So I've got to work out why and where the next spatial cell is. And it's in, we're probably in one of these blocks around here. So, hope you enjoy watching today, guys. And I'll see you next episode.